Okay, love, so it's me, your girl, lovely angel lady, playing all up in my head today. Um, I am bringing y'all a review on Hot Single Twist by Free Dress Equal. Let me show y'all. The model is rocking her in just a plain old 1B. Really simple. I have her in a TP 1B 30. One thing I can tell you right off the bat that I don't really care for is the fact that um, there are these little curly cues that kind of poke out in between the hairs. I guess they wanted to fill in space so that, um, I mean, I think it, had she been able to have more lace, even if you had to pay a little bit more, like all of through here would have been nice had it some kind of way been able to be in lace. Um, but yeah, I'm guessing these little pieces right here are for the sake of filling in I guess you can what you can do is like just take your fingers and kind of straighten them out a bit so that they're not so curly and just poking out of your unit because that looks really silly like for instance right here is really silly looking so if you just take your finger before you get ready to wear your unit you could actually do this while um, you actually have your wig sitting on like a little blockhead or wig head stand and uh, that way you can make sure that you get all of them because as you can see they're pretty much all throughout look at that I cannot I don't like that at all so um, as far as the concept goes brilliant there are a lot of braided lace wigs twisted lace wigs Senegalese twist um, coming out now but that is my least favorite thing about this one thus far um, yeah she is lace it could have been a little bit more natural around the hairline uh, especially um, the fact that you have to pay more money for a braided unit because of the braids um, you want to be able to do more with the hair and um, what I can tell you is if you kind of take the hair say like here and you can kind of like Wear her with like the little pompadour, a little hump or whatever you guys like to call it, here up in the front. I'm just giving y'all an idea, okay? But yeah, she's cute like that. So that's probably what I will be doing, y'all. I will probably be rocking her like that. Um, I will show you pretty much, see if you do this, there are no parting areas see that that's not parting space that's just there so you can see my actual cap so you might want to just with this one it's so weird because it has lace so you kind of want to wear a new cap but you probably just want to wear a black cap okay and I just I have this one on just for the purpose of showing y'all but this is pretty much the hairline you get here and you can adjust her to make her fit around here and squeeze the little ear tabs to make her fit, you know, better. She does have a comb in the back and two combs here. But, um, yeah, she's cute. Don't get me wrong. It's just those little hairs. And, you know, if, if she's going to be lace, it would be nice if they could have got her so that she could part. But it's that's not a big deal. Uh, for me, it's more so those little hairs poking up through there. I feel like my styling options are a little bit limited until she gets older. Um, once some of those hairs begin to kind of calm down and you might be able to just spray some water to relax, uh, you know, the curliness of those. Um, she's cute. She's a keeper, definitely. Definitely great, um, probably, possibly for working out. She doesn't feel like super hot on my head and there are, like I can actually feel my, my actual braids under here, my cap. So... Let me show y'all. So that is the length that you get with this diva. And I really do. I like her. Um, I do. It's just, um, like I said, those little hairs that kind of were like a little nerve wracking for me. But, um, yeah, if y'all have any questions, let me know. I will place all of the information in the information section. 
I will place everything in the description section for the video, okay? Um, yeah, but she she's cute, like I said. Um, for the purpose of not having to sit for five, six hours, seven hours, 14 hours, whatever it is that you've had to sit to get your Senegalese twist, definitely cute. If you want to pop a hat on with her, I know this diva would be like really cute with a hat, a scarf. There are so many different ways that you probably could get away with wearing her and I'm looking forward to just exploring the possibilities with her. So I'm probably going to go ahead and pin mine up uh, here and uh, just rock her like that today. So like I said, y'all let me know what y'all think. I really appreciate y'all watching. Um, but here's another close up. Yeah, and I have not tried, like, I have another braided um, wig, well, it's also twisted, but it's curly on the ends, and that's by a different company, by uh, the same company that my, uh, the first braided wig that I introduced y'all to was by. So, I will be showing y'all in the next few days that unit as well, so sit tight for that one, but man, I've been wanting me some Senegalese twists, and I have not been wanting to sit there and have them, so... She's still a winner, <laughs> even um, despite the little, I'll call it a little error, a little, it's like a tech issue, <laughs> but with the wig, <laughs> a little glitch. There's been a glitch in the system, talking about the unit. But yeah, she's very pretty. So like, as you can see, the more I tend to mess with this diva, she starts looking better and better. So maybe that's the key. You know, if, if you have to spray water on her to kind of loosen her up a bit, I would not drench her too much in water, but you probably have to and if you're going to wash her anyway, which I think the instructions, yeah, the instructions are in the back, okay? So, yeah, you can wash her just like any other unit. Well, I thank y'all so much for watching today. Your girl, L.A. loves you, and if you would be so kind... If you had not already, please subscribe to my channel. And um, I really appreciate all your love and support. If you have like requests and stuff like that, let your girl know. I know I've been crazy busy lately, but I'm definitely working on um, editing, getting up all the videos that I had to completely finish editing. So I thank y'all my loves for watching. Please subscribe. And if you were feeling this video, you found it helpful, please. And uh, y'all are bomb. You know what I'm saying? Y'all are bomb.com. So I pretty much do whatever I can for y'all um, with these videos. That's why I have my channel. So I love ya. Please follow me on social media. All right. Twitter, Google+, Facebook, Instagram. And what else? Lovely Angel Nista Lounge, blogs by Holla at your girl. I right, guess what? I love you and uh, I gotta get out. Peace out, y'all.